morning, everybody, and welcome back to Makefield Highlands Golf Club here at the Golf Academy. And today, um, we're going to work on bunker play. I know a lot of my students come and they get very frustrated with the bunker and the bunker shot, but we're going to break it down and uh, show you how easy this shot is. It's one of the shots in golf that are absolutely a miss. I mean, we don't actually have to hit the golf ball. But in order to do the shot well and to make it simple, it has to do a lot with your setup and setting you up for success. So a lot of the faults that players have when they're in the bunker are, one, they don't get the golf club down into the sand. Okay, that's the, probably the first part. Then the second part is they don't keep the golf club moving. These are the two elements for success if you're going to get out of the bunker. You've got to commit to hitting the sand and you've got to commit to a finish. Keep the club moving. So what I like to do is I like to get players set up so that they can hit the golf ball, or excuse me, they can hit the club or make the club get into the sand. Here's how you do that. So a lot of times what happens for players when they don't get the club down into the sand is set up. And what I see mostly from players is that they start and they open their stance too much. And then they play the golf ball off the back foot. Now that leads to a problem because the club just comes down too steeply and we actually do get into the sand, but we get down too steep into the sand. Or we hit down on top of the ball and we don't take any sand. So it can create two shots, uh, two misses that we don't and we want to eliminate. Here's what to do. Place the ball more in the front of the, well, for the front foot. Put your weight and place your weight more on that front foot. Then when you swing the golf club, the club will come up and then gently fall down and the club will get into the sand. I also am encouraging you to swing with more authority and make the club move faster to a finished position. We cannot be successful in the sand if we let the club stop. So if you're going to be successful in the sand, let's set up properly by placing the golf ball off the front foot, also placing more of your weight on that front foot, and then commit to a fuller follow through. Make sure you keep the club moving through the sand into your finished position. Keep practicing and enjoy the game. 